Despite several communities closing their parks from dusk until dawn to protect people from mosquitoes that could be carrying triple E. That threat is growing. The state now says there is a high risk of triple E in several communities along the south coast. Mike LaCrosse is in Middleborough and shows us despite the warning, many people are still taking their chances. The sun set over a lively crowd in Middleborough tonight. The weekly town hall summer concert series played on despite the increased threat of Triple E. We don't try to avoid the outdoors, but we do try to keep them safe. Stacy Morris was armed with bug spray to keep her crew safe from the mosquitoes. Always on my mind, but like I said, we just do our best to try to make sure the house is sprayed and they are sprayed when they head out at night. Middleborough is one of seven communities with a high Triple E risk level designation from the Mass Department of Health. The virus found in mosquitoes can be deadly. It's definitely something that you, you, you think about and you worry about. Parks and public spaces here in Freetown are closed from dusk until dawn because those are peak mosquito biting hours. It's been so hot and we had such a rainy early spring. Freetown health officials say they normally see elevated triple E levels, but not usually this early. Spraying is set to happen soon. Just be smart with what you're doing. Enjoy your summer. Just be aware that this is something that's going on. Triple E has not been found in any humans or animals this year. In Middleborough, I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.